Good afternoon. I'm standing here on Boltro Road and we're here to see a flat in Charter Gate, which is the development you're looking at. Although the flat in question is through that archway and in a, in a block at the rear. So just to, so you know where we are, Boltro Road, many years ago, this is actually the site of the old Haywards Heath Police Station. And most of Boltro Road was uh, semi-commercial. And most of these little shops and so on have been slowly turned into uh, flats and uh, converted into small offices. Um, location wise, we're in position A because literally 100 yards in that direction is the entrance to the station. You've got Waitrose just around the corner and Sainsbury's and also the Leisure Centre. If you want to walk to the town, sorry to look into the sunshine, but if I look up uh, Boltra Road to the south, that is uh, the top of here. You are literally on Muster Green and into the Broadway and round the corner into South Road shops. So great location. Um, do come in. So it's a nice gated complex. There's an automatic gate. You, if you buy a, a flat here, you actually um, uh, sorry. I'm just trying to get the codes right. Sorry, had a fun with the codes. Can't do two things at once. So basically, when you buy a flat here, you get a remote control to get in the gates. The block we're going to see, or the flat we're going to see, is that one just through the straight through that silver birch tree. But I'm just going to show you the big advantage with this flat is it's actually got an underground parking space. Everyone's got allocated parking, but this one in question, on a frosty day like today, you would have been grateful to have the parking space of this one because there's an underground space here. And I'm told it's the very end parking space on the left hand side. These are all storage bins and most people's uh, recycling bins as you can see. So anyway, come and have a look in the flat. Very well managed complex at Charter Gate. These were built by Persimmon Homes around the millennium. I actually own a flat in here myself, which I rent out. Uh, it's always been a very well managed complex. Service charge, I think, I can't remember, I haven't got the figures to hand, but I think it's around about 1,500 pounds a year for the service charge and 200 pounds a year for the ground rent. Uh, this one is, um, there's so many different sizes of flats in Chartergate and there is, this one is I'd say the second largest size or, or, or the set, or not the smallest, it's the size up from that. Whereas you'll see in a second you get a very big second bedroom, whereas some of the other flats, the, the second bedroom is very long and narrow. So anyway, do come in, this is the block, you've got an entry system, I'm now going to put my face mask on, so sorry if I sound a bit muffled. Rental wise, the owners actually live in this one, but uh, they actually originally rented it and liked it so much they actually bought it. So we're number 29. Let's take my shoes off. Do come in. Um, but rental wise, I'm just going to say I rent my apartment out in here for a thousand pounds a month, so I'd like to think you should be getting the same sort of thing. So entrance hall, various cupboards, handy little cloaks cupboard there, and a great big. This is a really useful cupboard. That's the airy cupboard with the tank, a ton of storage in there. Come through to the run. This is an east and west facing flat. So we're here roughly around lunchtime. So the sun's directly overhead at the moment, but uh, great big lounge. Now most flats, I think this flat is around about 850 square feet, which is pretty big. Uh, but this flat in question has got the bigger lounge. So it's a very large lounge, slightly L shaped. And then we're looking out the back. So that's looking around the corner. That's Paddock Hall Road. Across the road from you is uh, Winnells Park. And obviously looking down that way is where the Sainsbury's and the Leisure Centre is. And then this has got the separate kitchen. All very original. This is how these flats were built. So it's all very original. We've been very well cared for. Uh, boiler on there, that's been replaced. So that's a good thing. Judging by the sticker, it looks like that may have been uh, put in in 2020. So that's a big bonus. So nice kitchen, building fridge, freezer, oven, and a couple of other bits of freestanding. So big living space, remember that. And then you've got the main bedroom, which is a nice chunky double. Big wardrobe in here as well. So that's looking back through to where the archway was. Sensible size bedroom, and then the ensuite, which is again, very large. So shower, big shower, I mean, plenty of room. If you ever come to refit, refit this uh, shower room suite, you could put a massive shower tray in there if you wanted to. 
Then the second bedroom, which this is where the difference is between this and some of the other flats. The others have got, virtually looks very similar size, but this room is nowhere near as wide. If you're gonna have a double bed in it, you're literally gonna have to turn it round the other way and put it up against the window, because it's not wide enough to have it like this uh, bedroom is now. So again, overlook in the front. You know, if that was the main bedroom, you wouldn't be disappointed. And that's the bathroom. Again, decent size and all very clean and tidy. And the owners are only moving, they just want a little bit more space now. But there you go, great big flat. Uh, the floor plan will show the square footage. I'm pretty sure it's around about 850 square feet. It may even be slightly bigger than that because this is a big flat. But that you go, that's number 29 Charter Gate. Let us know if you're interested.